Um, so I managed to get the seat out. So I'll show you how I did it, just for other people to be aware how easy it is, but it's a little bit awkward. Um, well, this is because it's been there since it was installed and hasn't been removed, so it's a bit, not not too rusty, it's just solid with grime. What I have is at the bottom of the seat, there's these two locking pins. Um, basically, that's what goes through. Basically, sits in them like that. Nut on the inside, Allen key on the outside. These are pretty rock solid to get moving. Um, I managed to get them off with a cheap Chinese Allen key though and a pair of pliers. Once those are out, you need to keep these pushed down while hammering the ends because this slips in. It's, you've got to push it into the vehicle because it's wedged on top of that. So you just go inwards, and I assume now that that's got an Allen key fitting, I can actually take them out the floor as well. Let's just see if it turns, because that will be another answer to a question. They're a bit solid, those. Uh, they may need grinding off later. Um, but that's it. The seat, as you can see, is now off, and the life of grime, that's what I was saying. All that crap under there is why it wouldn't move.